It's not rethinking how we regenerate and rejuvenate the jobs that are going away. It's looking at the jobs of the future and making sure that we train and we innovate the young people to actually embrace that future. OCE's mandate has put us at the nexus of innovation in the province. It is our job to bridge industry and academia to drive commercialization. I think I'm optimistic because the brilliant minds far outnumber the nefarious minds and every young person that I meet, every entrepreneur that I meet, I just remain convinced that there's a lot of problems out there that despite the fact that they give us anxiety are going to be solved and addressed by a number of these people. Automotors build self-driving vehicles for industry. We're taking the same technology that's used in the Tesla car or the Google car, and we're putting it in an industrial form factor that's aimed at autonomous material transport inside of manufacturers and warehouses. My company is called uh, Cenas Machine Critical Incorporated, where we provide our customers the first data center in a box. Compression is developing the next generation of compression therapy products for the prevention and treatment of blood clots and the reduction of muscle fatigue. So we're really bringing compression therapy into the 21st century. We make a data collection tool that's a handheld device used by geologists and it takes a depth image and knows the positioning location and with that information it's able to intelligently detect critical information that geologists use to understand the stability of rock faces both underground and above ground. Our belief that our people are our strength, our belief that education, equitable treatment of people across this province, that's what's going to propel us forward and continue to allow us to be a leading society in this world. We will continue to support our best and brightest today for tomorrow.